A very decisive victory here tonight. When you get a one-on-one -on -one match like that, you hate to see one of them come up short. But that's just the harsh reality of it. Yeah, you can bet they're going to be talking about this match for quite some time. We'll see if the next match can equal that last one. Singles action on tap right now.
Hope the next match lives up to the hype of the rest of the card. Singles action coming your way. Up next, we have singles action. Oh, this is gonna be good. Making his way to the ring from Huntington Beach, California, weighing in at 282 pounds, the WWE Champion, Samoa Joe! One of the baddest dudes to ever play the game the first two-time NXT champion. A world-traveled, world-class competitor. One of the most well-rounded athletes sports entertainment's ever encountered. Yeah, the scenery may have changed in Samoa Joe's career, but the attitude is still the same. Samoa Joe does what he wants, when he wants. A very dangerous, Dangerous man. And his opponent from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, the United States champion. He is the apex predator, the Viper, Randy Orton. Randy Orton began his career by being known as the legend killer. Randy Orton is now simply a legend. Randy Orton's career wasn't built on alliances. The most important thing to Randy Orton has been winning championships. He has done that in a major way, a 13-time world champion.
The entire locker room should consider themselves warm. Tonight, the Apex Predator is coiled and ready to strike. If Randy Orton has it his way, tonight he returns to his rightful position at the top of sports entertainment. The only thing that would make this match more enjoyable to watch would be if I was calling it without you two bozos interrupting me. Drop down. Nice. Big clothesline. What a strike. Corey, tell me, just how much strength does carrying your opponent around like this take? Let's put it this way, Cole. Saxton would never be able to do it. What a stomp. Good grief. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Samoa Joe looking a little startled right now. He came into this match expecting a fight, and that's exactly what he's getting. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Cole. This is just a little bump in the road for him here. Nothing oh, to worry about. I know it's early, Oof. but if things stay the way they are, winning this match might just be a pipe dream for him. This might be it! Oh, my! Uppercut. Wow, oh, what a forearm. Look at this. Suplex. Ooh, what impact. Boy, he is rolling. Drop kick. Beautiful. Viper. Oh, 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 we know what's coming next. Oh, boy, do we ever. Vintage Randy Orton. I can't believe it, Michael. He's not going to like this. This could be it. An RKO! But he's got to capitalize now. Penny predicament. And he kicks out. Just power out. Randy Orton climbing up. Look at this. there. Oh, and he reverses it. out of the way. He's making a statement here with this attack. Oh, he's able to reverse it. He's got the shoulders down. He's got to be running on empty at this point. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. Standing drop kick. Great ups. Oh. Connects. 
There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come on, toughen up. Oh! <laughs> Looks like Randy Orton has broken a sweat. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. Oh boy, he is rolling. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. Oh boy, he is rolling. Taking off his feet here. And it's moves like that that make him so dangerous. Nailed it. Success breeds success, and he's definitely having some right now. Hung out to dry. Good night. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? And now... That should do it. He's going for the pin. Unreal performance. What an incredible match, and what a performance by that superstar. You're absolutely right, and look who's up on the stage. Oh, look who's here. It's a show of respect, Cole. It was a great performance. I find, a, find it hard to believe, Corey, that this is a show of respect. Things have been interesting so far, but now it's time for our main event. Singles action coming your way. Singles action is up next. You're not going to want to miss this. We have one of the best talents on the roster to date versus John Cena. underdogs in WWE history. A true Cinderella story after being told he could no longer compete inside of a WWE ring. Daniel Bryan fought long and fought hard and recaptured his dream and refuses to let go. It was on the big stage of WrestleMania where Daniel Bryan realized his dream capturing the WWE Championship. the bell and here we go this is the type of battle that you can show someone who's new to our brand of entertainment and say this is what wwe is all about when i looked at the card for tonight this one definitely stood out as one you don't want to miss it was tough you should get airline miles for that
Daniel Bryan is one of the most difficult WWE superstars to prepare for. Corey, what would you say is the best way to counteract the leader of the Yes Movement? Look, I don't particularly like most of the people in the crowd or watching on TV for that matter. So I wouldn't be bothered by Daniel Bryan's overwhelming crowd support, but crowds can get loud for Bryan. That can phase some superstars. Let's return to counteracting Bryan's fervent fan base. Byron, how can an opponent deal with Daniel Bryan and his passionate fans? It's going to take laser focus, Michael. And if you're a popular WWE star, you might want to consider a pair of earplugs for one night because the WWE Universe probably won't be in your corner if Daniel Bryan is your opponent. Sons now that got those shoulders on the mat. Looks like he's starting to tire. The WWE Universe celebrated Daniel Bryan's rise to the WWE Championship in 2013, but he wasn't quite as beloved as when he won the World Heavyweight title in 2011. That year, Daniel Bryan won the Money in the Bank briefcase and originally promised to cash it in at WrestleMania the next year. However, he couldn't wait that long and cash it in at TLC 2011 against an unconscious Big Show. You fellas brought up Daniel Bryan as Mr. Money in the Bank, and I personally thought he used that briefcase perfectly. He's the only Money in the Bank winner to choose a date and then shock the world successfully by cashing in before that. Many people have claimed that Money in the Bank is a blessing and a curse. That WrestleMania Daniel Bryan claimed he was going to cash it in at, instead he defended his championship there and lost it to Sheamus in 18 seconds. John Cena is measuring. Ooh, John Cena may have it. Thunderous slam. Wow, he goes for the cover. Wow, I can't believe he had the energy to kick out of that. I don't believe it. He refuses to lose. Oh, nasty impact. Ah, uh, setting him up in position here. On the second. Oh, what impact. talk about this superstar's latest spot in the power rankings, but if you ask me, those things are overblown. Beautiful technique. A lot of people are questioning how this superstar got such a favorable spot in this week's power rankings, but not to me. Seems perfectly logical. And John Cena's definitely getting in people's heads here. Oh, what impact! This is the Cena that's just about unstoppable. Oh boy, Byron, it's time for your favorite thing. I'm ready, Corey, are you? Are you ready for the five knuckle shuffle? Boom! This one is over. That is exactly what John Cena needed. Here we go a second time. Big slam. Here's his mo His shoulders are down. John Cena wins. trouble where is it and he's looking for him in the entrance way and from behind from the crowd a sneak attack an ambush from behind 
This is horrible. 